Good morning guys. Anyway, this is Pete Dahlgren. We're building Mirus Models F86 and what I'm doing here is getting ready to actually form this canopy over the side here and start building in to what I'm doing. Now, what I've done to do this is I've actually laid just regular plastic over the top and then to get a mold out of it, what I've done is I've just taken masking tape over the top. And what this does is this gives me a really good molding surface to do this because all this is going to be filled over and bond up because I am starting to build this, the rest of this interior. <clears throat> now, one thing is here is that you're going to notice there's not a lot of gap in here, but I did this kind of intentionally in there like this so that I could come up there and mold this and then I'll have a lot of sanding of course of course we always do now the real airplane drops way the hell down here you know so I've already done one side and but I'm going to show you how I mold this and it's just it won't stick it's all done with plastic under here, and this is what I'm using to mold. You're not going to see under here, but this is what the result is. And you're not going to see a lot of it, <clears throat> but when you get into it, it comes down like so. So, anyhow, I'll show you on the other side what the intention of this is. Now, you want this to sit down so it's over this and then when you pull this shut there is a curve in the real airplane you can do this with any of them and then this will get filled as well and blended so that this is very key to aligning the the canopies to the windshield and getting it and when it does open and close it'll be as such and it does actually move up and that's the way the real one actually does, in fact, work funny enough. But, after looking at my pictures and going to the museum, I notice there's a fairly hefty lip that goes all the way around it. So I'm just going to go ahead and fill this. And not really too worried about the weight because this doesn't weigh enough to actually worry about. So, anyway, I will um, go ahead and get this. And this gives you a little bit of a this gives you a really nice molding surface to get this detail and it goes all the way around like so and I'll show you this here in another video and so, well this is nothing more than Bondo and um, it works amazingly well and so once you have these particular parts done then you can come in and actually form all this and then I will you get this set up so that it is suitable to glass over the whole thing and then I will glass over the top of this just because and the inside of this will get glassed as well and then I'll paint it the gray and then I'll put all the black details and wires and all that other stuff in there now the <clears throat> everything's going to work in this so it's not a huge problem and I got a lot of things like the vent and all the kinds of things that are going to go in there. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and do this and we'll see you guys in a few minutes.